Hey guys, what is going on? It is your friendly neighborhood Zebraman back with episode 3 of UFC 2 My Career. Oh my goodness gracious. Last fight was crazy and this fight now I'm a bit afraid. So we got we got a choice here. This guy made it again? This guy, we're in the semi-finals and this guy was in the last one. Look, he's a wrestler though. That's the thing. His stand-up game is weak, so he's going to be trying to rip us to the ground. I think if they have gray, that means... I think, look, we'll go against this guy. I think the gray means that we're better than that. And we're, we, we, t we took ourselves, ourselves too seriously last time. We thought we were the, we were the bee's knees and we were going to win. And, of course, that didn't happen. It was kind of sad, okay? It was kind of sad that we didn't win. And this episode, we're probably, probably gonna win. You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say that now. We're gonna win this one. I want us to win this one. I think it's only fair that we win this one. Um, yeah, I just, I think we need to win this one. That's it. And I think that Nakamura has the skills to win this one. Now, what was the one we got to see in? It wasn't the ground training. It was, was it clinch? Was it clinch control? Yeah, B, we gotta be in clinch control. So, you know, we just, we'll, we'll set up some A stuff really quickly, get our stamina up, because we need that stamina. And I can't risk it going bad for us. But yeah, damn, that was uh, that was one hell of a fight. That guy was a lot better than we expected. And um, yeah, it was just, it was crazy. I'm just, I'm very excited. I'm very excited about this. <laughs> is this us gonna be busting through the doors again yeah look at us busting through the doors about to do some damage and we're against this guy so i think we do have the reach advantage this time because he's very short we'll, 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 we'll touch gloves you know out of respect touch gloves i thought he wasn't gonna touch gloves there i thought he was gonna do a psych um and you know he's he kind of went a bit crazy opening up there you know big a big a bit a uh, bit unchained you know unhinged with his opening his opening uh, attack there but nakamura nakamura's a beast you know he can he can take it he can give it countless times in the last match we almost lost but nakamura he didn't let that happen nakamura was an animal and he just he just kept going he didn't he didn't let anything phase him take him out of the game he was just he was all in and this match it's gonna be the same we're gonna be all in look at that head look how red his head is now we get this up spin with the kick no he blocked it all right front face kick spin with the other kick yes that's it that's the good combo and now he's down one minute into the match come on come on bait him tim that's it it's all over see <laughs> That's how the other one should have went, but it didn't. The other guy was a real competitor. This guy should not have made it into the finals or the semi-finals. Now we're gonna we're gonna finish the Ultimate Fighter. Okay, we're in the ending. We we've beaten the quarterfinals. We've beaten the semi-finals, and now our time again. It's that guy. It's the guy who has like zero stand-up game that we we've got to go against. This guy is a ground machine, so we gotta we gotta prepare for the ground machine. You know, he he's way better ground than us. He's way better uh, clinched than us. So we gotta be able to stand back and our defense up for that. So that's when we're gonna do this training session, ground defense, and then yeah, we'll check we'll see what it's like to, to do a fight, and yeah, let's let's go. This will give you a boost in fans if we win this. All right, we need that boost in fans though. We need to we need to we need to have the opportunity to become the UFC champion as fast as possible. So we gotta accept this. His ground game is 74. Now we gotta be able to defend that ground. So let's go to our training. You know, okay, I'll tell you what we're gonna need for our training. This guy is a big guy, okay? Look at the, look at our speed there. We got good speed. Now we need heavy hands here. We only got a C on this. We're gonna put it in. You know, we need a bit more strength in our hands, also our legs, damn it. Um, I don't wanna do that, I wanna do some ground training. Bottom drills, let's do, let's sim our bottom drills, okay? And then we'll go for quick hands again, because I, th I think that that's good enough for us. If we can, if we can get out of it from the bottom, we're, we're in good hands, so. 
is this my chin would go up my my is that my chin it's like the strength of my chin you know do i do i not get knocked down easily or uh, i don't know here we go though the finale of the ultimate fighter and i'm excited i'm excited we could win the ultimate fighter finally after all of this it'll be good it'll be good to win the ultimate fighter i'm hoping we do i'm just i'm hoping i'm praying that we win the ultimate fighter because if we win the ultimate fighter we get more fans and it clo oh i banged my control out the desk and we get a better chance at getting that ufc featherweight championship shot so here we go oh we're in an actual ufc octagon okay 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 so look at this we get to see it here his reach is nowhere near mine. His height is nowhere near mine. Emilio Ver Vargas. And we got Bruce Buffer introducing. We're gonna skip past you, Bruce. I'm sorry, man. We gotta get into this. We gotta, we're hyped, we're hyped, okay? Here we go. We're gonna unleash now. We got the big octagon here. Oh, kick to the face like that. We can get him knocked out instantly. The hype is real for us. All right, stamina is way down. That was a mistake. You know what? No, it wasn't a mistake. This is part of the game plan. Look at that. Look at that. 20 seconds into the Ultimate Fighter. 20 seconds. 21 seconds it took us to finish the goddamn fight. If that doesn't say that Nakamura is a force to be reckoned with, then I don't know. Did you see that? Did you see that? You probably missed it if you blinked because Nakamura is now the greatest and fastest fighter in the whole world okay look at that look at look just knocked these were just these weren't even l1 l2 strikes or you know these weren't heavy these were just light this guy has the chin of, of a two-year-old he just went down and his leg he probably broke his leg we ended his ufc career guys look at look at oh no this is when we're grounded and pounding on that was it look at that boom he keeps coming back for more though Damn. <laughs> The official decision, Nakamura, the undefeated Nakamura, comes into the octagon, the big octagon, right? He comes in and he's hyped. He sees the crowd. He's like, okay, this is it. This is what counts. I need to do this for me. I need to win this. The hype, the people behind him. He gets the trophy. Look at that trophy. He's so hyped. And that's it, guys. Look at that. Nakamura, Atlas, Naka freaking Mora becomes the ultimate fighter. And it, like that was, <laughs> I don't know what to say about it. His MMA record is now one zero zero. He's won his first ever UFC fight. I mean, I'm hyped for it. <laughs> he's won, he's won the Ultimate Fighter. I want to see how many fans we get off this, and how far away from Conor McGregor's title we are. Twenty one seconds in the UFC to win a fight. Now, it's nowhere near Conor McGregor's win, but we're going to knock Conor McGregor out the same way we knocked that guy out. That's the guarantee. And if we don't, we'll still win against Conor McGregor, man. Oh, I'm feeling lightheaded because of all this all of this hype from this fight. I'm just, I'm just excited. This was crazy, crazy good. Nakamura is your winner. Ain't no if, ands, or buts about it. Nakamura is the ultimate fighter. Now, we got 7,998 fans, and then if you add in my subscribers, we hit 8,000 exactly. So, there we go. There we go. I mean, this is exciting. I'm pretty happy about this. We're... How far are we from the, the thing we know? We are probably at the bottom. Looking for that Nigerian flag. Um, where is Bay Park? <laughs> where is your boy? Oh, he's 56. I bet you there was a thing in the menu that tells me that. That's, I bet you there is. Where does it say it? No, it doesn't actually. So, all right. So the fight short notice. Um, I think that's what we'll do. That'll be the next episode though. Yeah, we'll, we'll take on the, the short notice fight. Um, we'll get a lot more stuff for it. And that guy isn't... He's got stand-up game like us. But he's, you know, he's worth the win. If we beat him, you know, that'd be good. And we could go against someone else. Like, this guy we'd knock out instantly. But 
you know, we, we get the short camp, we'll do that. We're on the undercard, you know, it's it's worth something. But anyway, guys, thank you for watching this episode of USC 2 Karuma. We'll be back again with episode 4 where we fight that guy in a short notice fight. So until next time, guys, don't forget to leave a like. I've been your friendly neighborhood Zebraman. Peace. Hey guys, what is going on? It is your friendly neighborhood Zebraman. And before I'm even going to do the introduction to the potential finale, I'm going to get straight into this. Guys, this is the impossible universe mode.